Ah, here we go again against Mr. Olegas. Yeah, yeah, okay. I'll just play this game and see what happens. I mean... <laughs> okay, what is he doing actually? I think I, against the King's Indian he's playing the, the exchange variation. So I won't, um, I won't allow that so easily. Get him near his desired um, boring endgame so quickly. It's not particularly great, but it does exchange stuff, which is what he wants. Yeah, it is not any good because white has more space and shouldn't trade, but he's trading everything anyway in every position. He will also trade queens now. It's just better to play queen f4, but he will probably take anyway. <laughs> it's just what he does. Or queen e3. Maybe he will play the better move. No, of course not. Okay, so what am I going to do here? F6 or knight c5? I don't know. It's, it's really not much happening. Trying to be quick here. Just completely equal. I mean, <laughs> like completely. <laughs> um, no. But yeah, I'm ahead on the clock here. Yeah? That's not. That's not bad. Yeah, putting those on dark squares. Okay, so let's not blunder some stuff here. Go to d6. I've been quick here, right? That's not bad. If anybody is a little bit better in this endgame is actually Jeff. black, but it's it's still nothing nothing serious in particular. Um I can I can try to claim that it's nice for me that I have a pawn on C4, which is on a light square there. But it's nothing serious at all. It's just equal, nothing going on, dead, whatever. <laughs> okay, so he puts something more on a light square. Hmm. What, 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 why, why exactly? Is he going to play knight to a4 or what? I don't know. Bishop e6, possibly next. Huh, really? Hmm.
really get that. Yeah, well, one problem against him is that he's a good endgame player, and sometimes he just shuffles without any purpose just to play on time, but sometimes he just plays good moves, and you have to kind of be very alert that that when he does play the good moves, you are you are ready to respond correctly and not do anything anything stupid. And um, I'm not sure if this is maybe one of the cases of a good move. B7 hangs. Mm. I've check here. Ah, this is interesting. I can also play bishop b3 here. Mm, yeah, I'm not sure, and my, my time is ticking now. Bishop b7 and king c7 is a double attack, so that's not going to work. Check. sure if I can Check. play for a win here. Can I play for a win here somehow? I don't know. I would like to, but I'm not, not sure if I have something. Game there. drawn. Yeah. Okay, it is already three times. Mm, maybe I had some chances there. I don't know. It looks, this looks strange. It is this knight a4 looked strange to me, but maybe it's not so bad. Compass on zero 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 all Check. the time. Yeah, it's Check. probably probably it's just it's just equal. And he has no real alternative there. If he tries to do this, I have knight b five. It's just completely dead. This this whole position all of the time. But I wanted to be quick there and not lose on time. So it's not very exciting. But what Check. can you do? It's very difficult against him because he just trades everything. Yeah, even if it's completely bad. Yeah, knight e five for example. Yeah, is debatable. But you you wouldn't really normally trade all those pieces here, yeah, and especially not queen d8. But he just wants to trade everything. It's just better to play the queen to f4 or to e3 and keep a bit, bit of more pressure on. But he will trade everything and always go for the simplified position. So at least I was was quick there. Didn't um, didn't spend much time. Okay, not very exciting, but it's a decent draw. Thanks for watching.